Johnny's Cheap cleaning out the freezer and the fridge. We got some leftovers. Remember we had that roast, we sous vide some roast beef and we have leftovers, that's good. I found some mashed potatoes in the freezer, clearing it out. We're gonna do that with some, what are these? 29 cents at Aldi for the brown gravy mix, a little bread, classic comfort food. Hot beef sandwich with gravy, good stuff. Hey, click like if you like the video, do that. And subscribe, if you don't subscribe, do it. We just do two videos a week. You get notifications when we have a new video. I'm gonna put this together. This is awesome comfort food, hot beef sandwich. So here I got my mashed potatoes. These actually reheat very well. You freeze, you have leftovers, you freeze them, you reheat them. Right there, they're thawed out. I may add a little bit of milk or a little bit of butter. I'll see after they're heated up. But mashed potatoes, make a bunch of them and freeze them. It's really easy. So the brown gravy mix, I get it at Aldi. It's like 29 cents or 39 cents a packet. Best bargain around for gravy mix. And I'm doing some extra because we're gonna use the extra gravy for something else down the road. New video coming. So I'm doing two packets. For each packet, it's a cup of water. So I got it, I got it turned up to almost high and we're gonna stir in the cold water. Just whisk it up and heat it up. It's that simple. And it'll get thick and voila, you have gravy. And you like to use this and have it on hand to like put in stews and stuff. I put it in stew, too. any beef soup, uh, beef and noodles, I put it in there as extra flavor and I, it's extra thickening. It's really, really versatile and very cheap. A lot of flavor. So my gravy's heating up, my taters are heating up. This is my thin sliced roast beef. We sous vide this earlier in the week. It's, it's thin sliced. You could of course use roast beef from the deli. You could do a, a chuck roast, have it chunked up. But I'm just gonna heat this up low. I'm not gonna do it on full power because I don't want it to get brown on the edges, just warm it up, because we're gonna cover it with hot gravy. All right, everything's heated up, gravy's done, taters heated up, roast beef heated up, let's build a hot beef sandwich. Now some people, you can serve these open face. that's how I always thought they were until I met Mrs. Cheap, and she said, no, it's a sandwich, you make a sandwich and cut it in half. And I didn't know what a hot beef sandwich was until I worked at the Hy-Vee Deli in high school. Yeah. And a little old lady asked for one and I was totally confused and the manager came over and like put it together real quick and I'm like, oh, that looks good. Here's how you do it. Okay, so there you go. You got your beef in there. Put the second piece of bread on top and then you, you cut it in half. And if you want to be like a restaurant, I mean, these are so big in diners. This is like, you know, the $5.95, $6.95 lunch special. Yep. So you split it in half there. If you want to be like the diner, you use an ice cream scoop to put the mashed potatoes right there. A little bit more. <laughs> I mean, it's gotta be a hearty meal, right? And our gravy, all done, thickened up. And go over the top of the whole thing. Lots of gravy. If this doesn't fill you up and make you feel all warm inside. Oh, oh. like I said, this is comfort food at its finest. And this is this is just diner cafe food. And really the stuff, I mean, this is all leftovers pretty much. Uh, let, yeah. yeah, yeah, it is all leftovers except, you know, the, the fresh bread. There we go. That is a hot beef sandwich. Right there, tastes great with leftovers from the freezer and uh, you know previous meals and cheap gravy from Aldi. Enjoy, we will. Hey, thanks for watching Johnny's Cheap. Follow us YouTube, Twitter, Instagram, Facebook. Click like, subscribe if you haven't subscribed. Follow us. Thanks for watching. We're about to enjoy some great hot beef sandwiches.